All right, everyone. Welcome to FIFA 14. Um, this is probably the game that I play the most. So I decided to make an LP. I got it for PC. I've been playing it for a while. Um, one of the uniquenesses of what we're going to do here is I'm going to play all manual. Um, and I don't know how many of you have uh, played FIFA before, but uh, this is not <laughs> easy. And it will make me rage quite a bit. Um, I'll be completely honest, I've played some in manual, but only on the passing, and um, come on, there we go, it's still fast loading on the PC. I've been playing for the PlayStation for a, quite a while, uh, but I've never played, or recorded for that matter, for the PC, um, so I got it now, I decided to play, I recorded a little bit, and the footage was terrible. I'm still not completely happy with how this is going, but at least it should be okay. Um, but yeah, I'm going to play FIFA. I love this game. I play it a lot uh, on the PS3. I have FIFA 14 for the PS3 too. Um, and it's going to be interesting because I know a lot of you haven't played FIFA. And maybe, I don't know how many of you watching this right now have played FIFA before. Or like the game or the series for that matter. But I've been playing the game, uh, the FIFA series, probably since... Actually, I, the first FIFA game that I bought... Um, was FIFA 96 for the Genesis. Um, yeah, that's... Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ooh. So yeah, it was a long time ago. Oh, it ha um, And FIFA 14, for all the good that it has, has a lot of bad stuff. And I'll tell you the primary reason why this game um, is the game that I played the most and the game that makes me rage the most as well. Which is why I thought this might be a fun LP to do. Uh, this game has a lot of cool things. The graphics are pretty good. They've changed some stuff from FIFA 13 where now they say there's less emphasis on speed of the player. Um, but there's some issues with movement that are not realistic, even though they keep insisting that they are. Which, like, if I want to change directions, look how much time it took. I mean, that's not real for a lot of players. And you'll see... When I get to the higher skilled players, it doesn't make sense. Oh, come on. Um, nonetheless, playing in manual is going to be interesting. It's going to be a change. Most most people don't play manual. They play with uh, assisted on everything, which uh, the difference is all the, all the changes, player changes, uh, saves, goalkeeper saves, passing, everything is directed the right way when you press it so if you press pass over there it would go there regardless of where i pointed and playing in manual it requires me to point at the right spot or otherwise i miss the pass or the cross or whatever and shooting is my problem i i've never played with shooting being uh manual and so it's going to be very interesting to see how that goes going to go um uh, as I get to better and better players, I'm going to try to be a little bit more skilled. Here, I'm overdoing it because my players can't even move, let alone. Whoa! <laughs> Manual shooting for the win. Dang. Okay, that's my first, like, amazing goal with a... Maybe this is a bronze player, actually. <laughs> Oh man, that was flipping awesome. This is the, the advantage of playing manual, is that when you score a goal like that, you feel like, I did that. It wasn't like the computer directing uh, where the ball is gonna go. And I, I wish more people paid manual because if I'm gonna be playing online and I'm gonna be um, raging a lot because I'm gonna be losing a lot of games. And hopefully I'll get better, but um, I know that I'll be losing a lot of games, and it's it's going to be a, a rage fest for many reasons. FIFA drives me nuts, uh, and I love it. <laughs> uh, but to be completely... Oh, come on, get it. There you go. Come on. Whoa, whoa. My gosh, he's slow. I forgot what I was saying. Oh, with manual, you just have this accomplishment feeling. When you actually score a goal, you make a good cross, you make a good pass. Um, and I wish more people did it, but they don't because, you know, it's the entry, it's hard, it's, uh, it's very hard. And like I said, I've been playing on manual um, on passing and stuff, so you'll notice that I don't make a lot of. Ooh, this guy, is it the same guy? 
Yeah, it's the same guy. He's good. I like this guy. Um, so there's a there's an uh, you have to adapt and adjust and learn. I was gonna do a, I was gonna do a, finesse shot. It wouldn't work with these players, honestly. So the by the way, changing subjects. I'm ADD. If you haven't noticed, um, KFC. What does that stand for? That's Crafters Football Club. Uh, Crafters, for those of you who don't know, it's uh, the clan that I started for Minecraft back in 2011. And, you know, good, good group of friends that's what I've been playing for a long time. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. Ah, dang it. Bad cross. Um, and so, ooh, there you go. I decided to use that as a... It's not the name that I use for my... Um, PS3 team, and I have to show you my PS3 team because I have a pretty good team. Um, oh, yeah, nice, feels good. Uh, my PS3 team is way, way, way better than this. Um, obviously, I just started this one. I this is all from free packs. I bought the deluxe version they had for sale, uh, which gives me 1500. Uh, uh, FIFA points, which allows me to buy some packs. Yay, in-app purchases. <laughs> I think if I actually bought those um, from the FIFA store or whatever they call them, Origin store maybe, it would have been, I think, 15 bucks or so. So it's it's a decent promotion. Ah. Immobile. <laughs> I don't know how he moves. He's immobile. <laughs> oh, gosh. Anyway, also something I'm, I'm trying to figure out is that how I want to do this. I'm, I'm thinking of doing um, maybe two full games per episode, but I might switch into um, into doing best off and highlights and stuff like that if my games get really boring and my commentary does not keep up. Um, I do know that if I do play online... Uh, come on. Nice. Come on, come on. Ah. Uh, the chip sucks on this guy. Okay. When the guys come in in the middle. There. Ooh. What the heck? Is that an offside? Oh. Uh, yeah, if my commentary gets boring and stuff, I'll, I'll probably start cutting it off. But I don't want to spend a lot of time editing because I want this to be like a, I don't know, maybe twice a week series. Um, I don't know. You guys kind of have to tell me because I don't want to do this if nobody's interested. But I think there's not a lot of players playing online with uh, manual mode. So there might be some attraction to that. Oh, sorry. Wrong move. I'm still a noob when it comes to skill, sh skill moves and stuff. But I'm pretty, de I'm pretty good. Uh, if I have to s specify my type of playing, I'm fairly good at passing and defense. I'm pretty terrible at shooting, uh, which today is not indication of that, but I am. I really am. And I'm pretty decent at, like, general movement, and um, I think passing is definitely my biggest skill. I can I can do law, passed and law passes and stuff uh, fairly easy and fairly well, fairly well, even in manual mode. Man, seriously, I want to see this goal again because this was awesome. Dang. I don't know what's going on with the controller. It selected all those things all the way down here. All right, so we're killing them. Um, I might actually turn off the commentary. It's getting on my nerve, <laughs> especially if I'm commentating the game. Um, it will drive me nuts and probably drive you nuts too. So there we go. No, 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 no. That was a goal. <laughs> I hate this dance move. Uh, I do it all the time on accident because it's, I think, uh, LB and Y. <laughs> How did he kick that ball out either? Like, the ball was already inside and he kicked it through the post. There's so many glitches like that on this game. It just... Uh, come on. Bad pass. Bad direction. Good idea. So, 
I don't know what type of commentary people do in FIFA games. I don't. I don't watch a lot of um, FIFA LPs. Um, I might start watching FIFA LPs, <laughs> uh, to be honest with you, because I do enjoy and I, I want to play some multiplayer as well. That's probably the one thing I'm most excited. Gosh, the, I'm the most excited about is. Um, come on, run. There. I'm the most excited about is probably. Uh, come on, penalty. Ah, oh, volley sucks for me. I'm pretty terrible at volleys. He seemed frustrated. Uh, the animations and cutscenes are very, very boring. And um, FIFA 14 for PC, even though I probably have a better graphics card and pr processor than the PS4 and Xbox One. Eh, maybe not. Uh, but I could. Um, it still doesn't have next-gen graphics, which is insanely annoying. Pull middle. Oh, so slow. Yeah, tired too. Sorry, my bad. My bad guy. Um, it doesn't have next-gen graphics. Uh, the graphics are way better than the PS3 for one simple reason. I'm playing this at um, tw full resolution on my 27-inch screen which is 2560 by 1440. So it's double 720p. Um, and to be completely honest, that makes graphics so much smoother. It's ridiculous. Oh, garden rats. I don't know what I said. Uh... But I tried the NVIDIA recording thing, um, the NVIDIA, NVIDIA Experience recording, NVIDIA Shield, or whatever that thing is called. Uh, Shadowplay, sorry. And um, it records way better, but I'll have to record my audio differently. Because right now I use DX Story with two... Um... Ooh! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my gosh, I did it perfectly, and then I cannot shoot <laughs> from close range. I aimed wrong, it's so hard, and I'm playing with a different controller. I got the Xbox 360 controller for Windows, and uh, I'm still not used to these, to playing with an Xbox, because I, like I said, I have the game, I've been playing the game for several years on um, the PS3, and before that on the PS2. And before that, on the Genesis, I did play for the PC. Um, I the only ver PC version that I bought was '98, um, but I did play '99 and 2000 on the PC. But I always played with a keyboard. Oh no! Go oh, uh, why did he? Those movements on some players just bother me to no end. Come on! Why didn't the other guy come in? I was waiting for him. Oh, wrong pass. Okay, stay on him. I use um, the shield defense with the, the second guy. Bring a second guy all the time. And then I'll, I'll defend with the, that guy, with the guy that I have selected, and have the other guy kind of close down on him so I can worry about, okay, like here, I'm, I'm going to get the other guy close on him so I can shield the other guy, the possible pass. That's how I play defense. Um, just a tip for those of you who are interested in that kind of stuff. Um, so I play with the sprint on the top right. So in this case, R at T, I think. I have to get used to the names on the Xbox. R RB. RT is the bottom one. So I play with the sprint on RB. Play with uh, finesse shot on L. B. Come on. Ooh. Yeah. Great chance. Oh, what a cheeky attempt. Ugh. My bad. I'm getting cocky here. Sorry. I think I can do this. I don't have any players that are skilled, I don't think. I should really look into that, actually. Ooh. Oh, my gosh. So much time to turn. You're losing, dude. Why are you doing all these... 
Oh. Come on, get that. Jeez. I got this. I got this. Lucas. Oh, what a vital stop. All right. Recovered. There we go. Where's the other guy on top? No, wrong pass. Sorry. He's into the challenge. This guy, number six here, is good. He's getting my... Uh... Sorry. Oh, ooh, that was not too bad. So this immobile guy is not... He turned around. He flipped around. Uh, so, like, the way I'm playing this game, and I'm kind of getting a feel for uh, recording length and stuff, I'm not sure this is going to work in terms of recording the full game. Um... Do let me know what you think. Uh, got it. If you think that it could work. Because I don't want to bother or bore you guys. Uh, uh, foul, foul, call it. Yeah. Alright, let's see here. Okay, pass the guy near me. No! No, 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 no. Ooh. Aha! Um. The come on, go. This guy's kind of fast. Ah. Uh, too much pressure. Too much pressure. Yeah, people watch. Yeah. Oh, he ended the game. All right, we won our first game. Well, second game for me, but first game for the recording. Four zero. With our starter pack, with an amazing goal by Sergi Gullo. Gullo, whatever. Um, was this good? I don't remember this one. It was okay. It was a place shot. That was good. Um, by the way, this silence now, it's where the music would start. <laughs> uh, no music to avoid trouble. There you go. Um, look at them thanking the players. It's another thing that bothers me about FIFA... Oh, there he is. Oh, he's my defensive midfielder. He owned today. Okay, so this guy, these guys, their goalkeeper is best game. I got some coins. Match highlights. This is, in, it's terrible. So look at this. I bet half of my um, good shots are not even here. They're not because this guy doesn't have any more, and he got a few good shots. It never gets... It's just ridiculous. If you're especially online because you can't really pause to save a recording or something, it drives me absolutely insane. Oh, so I played a game, I guess, and I won a game, or whatever that was, the task. Um, I'm going to pause the recording here real quick. I'm going to check how it's coming out. Um, I'll try to think of some other things, and uh, we'll uh, go play the next game. All right, be right back. All right, guys, that kind of worked. I'm not going to be bothered too much. Um, this is a very long video, longer than I was expecting. Uh, I think that in the future, um, well, I'm going to do another game today. Uh, but I think that in the future, we're going to do um, cutscenes, or not cutscenes, but I'll do highlights of each game. I'll talk a little bit less per um, uh, per game, not not as much commentary as as much as commentating. Um, and so, I mean, I don't know if everybody's okay with 30 minute episodes, this one will be a little bit longer. Um, but especially when I get into online mode, there's not much I can do for, um, game times. Uh, and so I'm pretty much, I don't know. There's nothing I can do. By the way, I changed the recording mode right now to being, um, okay, let's shut those guys. Or at least more than it is right now. Uh, I switched to recording with NVIDIA uh, Shadowplay, which is way faster. I have no lag whatsoever, which is flipping amazing. Uh, commentary. Let's put it half for now. Probably going to bother it even more than it did. Eh, it's okay. Uh, but there's no lag with this thing. It's kind of amazing. I was using DX Story before. Um... Because of that's how I what I use for Minecraft, 
But I wish Minecraft let me record with Shadow Play too, or Shadow Play would let me record with Minecraft as well. But it doesn't do it because it's open only DirectX, which actually bothers me that they're doing this with only DirectX, since it's a Microsoft only technology. Whoa. Yeah, but it's fluid as heck. I love this. And it's actually doing more compression than DX Story, so I don't know. Well, I'm assuming that it has better access to the har to the hardware than DX Story can have to use the graphics as a recording or as a compression system. Codec, whatever they call them. Oh my gosh, this guy is bad. Slow. What team is this again? Kaiserslautern. I think. Ugh. Almost got it. Come on. Yeah, I'm. I'm. Ugh. Oh, come back, dude! I turned around. Thank you. <laughs> I love those fancy moves when the put there. See, I love doing these passes. Come on. Oh, manual sucks sometimes. Ooh, that was actually fairly close. My player. He's lefty. Lefty. Come on, let's put it to it. He's lefty, but he's not amazing. Wow, actually, <laughs> never mind what I said. He's fairly amazing. That was not where I wanted that pass. Offsides. Ugh. I have those little glitches. Well, not a glitch, but see, it's like twitching back and forth. And then it's really almost impossible for you to plan a pass. That is not realistic at all. Like, players don't twitch like that on the offside line. Come on, I need you to open up. Or right here, okay. Oh man. Yes. Oh, every time I look at that name, I think immobile. Or impossible, because it's close to impossible. Oh no, no, it's Kobenjagen. Kobenjagen. If I have any uh, German speaking, I think this is German. Uh, viewers, I'm sorry for butchering the name of that. Probably a town, I'm guessing. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, so much time. Oh, I felt that. I felt that. I was pointing at the wrong direction. Um, I don't know if I was saying earlier um, in the first game, but I'm playing with the Xbox 360 controller, which is very different from my beloved PS3 DualShock. Um, so it's especially switching to manual at the same time as doing the switch it adds to a certain level of novelty that will cause oh come on go back jeez no that's not where I tried to pass the ball to well it didn't feel like I was pointing that way but I am playing manual so uh Come on, can we get the ball? Oh my gosh, what happened to you? I wasn't even looking at you anymore. No, no, not you. Ugh, I hate when they change as a player like that. I didn't want that guy to get the ball. Ugh, couldn't do it this time. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> I want to get another goal out of that guy. This team is a little bit better, it feels. This defensively, I think. Come on, pressure on him. Pressure on him. Pressure on him. So slow. Okay, you're not gonna take the. Oh, come on. So slow. And then this? Gosh, look how much time it took him to come back. And <laughs> what the heck was that? Oh, lordy. 
Mm. But as a as a a very light review of FIFA 14, there's a lot of things that I like and a few things that I despise, which pretty much unfortunately ruins the game for me, even though I cannot stop playing because I love soccer games and there's nothing else. And I've played historically I like PES or PES or I think here it was International Superstar Soccer um, but everywhere else in the world was Pro Evolution Soccer PES in Portuguese like we called it even though the initials are not in Portuguese because <laughs> it's Pro Evolution Soccer um, especially Pro Evolution Soccer 6 for the PS2 was probably one of the game soccer games that I played the most and it was definitely the funnest game to play like multiplayer oh, why did he stop see that's another annoyance like when you switch players a lot of times they have this brain fart where they freeze especially defense it makes it so like for such bad mistakes come on go oh okay let's go for a shot no he lobs his shots which are okay from a distance but suck if you don't have a good angle on them um, but Pro Evolution Soccer 6 was amazing. Pro Evolution Soccer, when they switched the year, the, the year names, uh, 2007, 2008, whatever, they ruined the game. Honestly. Pro Evolution 6, um, I think was the last one that was like, no, 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 that was not offside. Aha! There he is. My um, my amazing player. Um, yeah, Pro Evolution Soccer completely ruined the game somehow. They, they're the new games feel still feel like I'm playing an arcade back in the 90s. Uh, I downloaded the demo for today, to this year's 2014, and same exact feeling. Uh, if this was um, uh, an arcade from the 90s, it would have been amazing graphics. Uh, but like everything about the game is very arcadey. Um, come on, you can't stop it there. The the menus, the it's just is I don't know. I hate this thing how it flips down. I don't know for it's probably a bug with the controller or something or the game. Um, but the the latest versions feel well. Even the old versions felt a little arcadey, but. It was really good to play. And so, you know, you'd put up with the menus and the poor game modes and the lack of licenses and all that stuff because it was an amazing game. And so people were willing to give out, give up on having, you know, licenses, which anybody that plays sports games knows that having licenses is like, come on. Oh, just not enough power on that pass. Um... Ooh, that was not a bad shot. Um, that was actually a good shot. Dang. Um, but this whole arcade mode of just doesn't cut it when the... Well, the licenses, not having the licenses is a big issue when you don't have anything else that the game is can be valued for. Uh, FIFA really stepped up since... I'd say 2008 or just about um, and they they got the licenses they already had a license they've always had licenses so that was never the issue um, but interestingly like FIFA was not the most popular game um, early on for uh, people that liked soccer games oh but what did I do uh, I think I pressed the wrong button uh, was not the favorite game of, of many pro players or like players that actually love playing soccer games but it became quickly when when uh, I think they added uh, the alternative like layout gamepad layout a few years back um, and that and they added uh, the alternate was matching pro evolution soccer's layout and in about the same time they, they added some features that pro evolution had for gameplay um, and some just changes on the gameplay they really stepped the game up um, Ugh, shots, I suck at these. That really moved the game, in my opinion, into... Uh, yeah, still 
tons of glitches and imperfections and crap like that. But it moved the game up in my in my book and in a lot of people's books because it quickly became the most popular game. And unfortunately, I almost feel like Pro Evolution is dead. Honest, honestly, it's not officially. And again, it's it would be sad if they did kill it. Konami. Oh oh. Ooh. My players are so slow. Um, well, supposedly speed doesn't count anymore in this version. That's what they tell you. Okay. <laughs> Amateur. Oh my gosh. No. His shot is terrible. I got to get rid of that guy. My defensive midfielder has a better shot than this, my striker. What are you doing, buddy? Are you dancing? Dancing with the stars? The stars being my players. Ha! I hate this celebration. Stop it. <laughs> I don't like it. They always get, like, into each other's. Look, look at it. Oh. That was a good goal. Um, but again, I'm playing amateur mode. The one thing, okay, last FIFA 13, just to keep up a little bit more context to this series and me and the game and stuff. FIFA 13, I played a lot of it, obviously. Um, oops. But, okay. Why did I freeze now? Oh, because I have a lot of room to go with my player. That's why. <laughs> I think that's like my is he defense number four he might be a uh, my central defender <laughs> that was a sweet move um, so FIFA 13 I played a lot of it <laughs> yeah amateur and I played top level um, in like single player seasons in ultimate team I was constantly first division um, with constant wins they I had the they had difficulty levels above world class is the default highest one but once you start playing seasons and stuff it unlocks uh, ultimate and then legendary <laughs> legendary wait for it um, and I played in one games and legendary I found that world class was actually one of the hardest difficulty levels even though it's not the highest it was just the hardest to play because of AI stuff change to that player um, so I'm experienced player oh, I did it again sorry um, but I for some reason I still when I moved to 14 there's some glitches in the game well, no, I don't want to call them glitches there's just some quirks of the game that make me feel like a complete noob I'll show you my record on the PS3 but I've been playing a lot of online seasons so not a lot of single player uh, but my current online record on seasons for the ultimate team is like, I think I have 130 defeats, which is ridiculous. I think I didn't even have that many last year of way more games and uh, 100 wins. So I'm negative on the record and like probably 70 ties or something like that. Um, so they changed some things that really affect. I can't get past like season five or something like that. I love automatic or manual goalkeeper. I can actually jump when I want. So here, I come out with him and I jump when he makes a shot. I can actually force him to jump, um, which avoids some of the glitches with the keepers. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. Um, man, I, I'm all over the place at the commentary today. Uh, I'm just getting it's very different for me to play this game commentating because I'm <laughs> oh not enough power anymore tired tired oh come on I'm getting tired of commentating it's hard on a game that you're not you oh on a game that I'm not used to like this oh what the heck was that Come on, come on, Guillo. Why are you so high up? 
Ow. <laughs> there we go. Hey. Oh. Dang it. I'm not, I don't do subs. <laughs> I don't do subs. I know that it makes a huge difference, actually. Uh, and I, I do concede a lot of goals at the end of the game, which goes to say a lot. No, that was not who I wanted to pass it to. Ooh. Um, but, yeah, I'm thinking that for future I'll do... Um, I'll do like highlights. Oh my gosh. This guy sucks. He scored that goal, which I still don't know how I did it. But like if the shot is not a perfect power, it he can't get it aimed at right. All right, second game, first episode ends, two victories. We're playing amateur. This is a very basic team. This is a free pack. Um, but I'm like I said before I'm pretty experienced with the game so it's not like I'm just playing it for the first time uh, oh Bagaza that's one of my best players he was the man of the match and he didn't feel like he played that much um, how many shots on target <laughs> one of five it was his goal <laughs> um, but yeah I mean I hope you guys enjoy this this series this, this could be a fun for me because um not that other series aren't fun, but for me, this is the game that I play when I'm not even recording. This is my default game. I come home and I think of playing some game. I play FIFA. I absolutely adore FIFA. It's one of my favorite games ever. Um, even with all what I hate about it, I love it. <laughs> and so I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, just a note on the points up there. The FIFA points are like currency in game. They're in-app purchases. They suck severely. Uh, in my opinion, they kind of ruin the game, but that's understandable this is like a card game you know, you know you can buy packs and random cards come out i bought the deluxe version that was on sale and so i got those 1575 points which will allow me to buy not that much but a few packs i'm waiting for some sales on some packs that will give me um uh, there are some today even that uh doesn't really are not that good because they were 300 uh fifa points and they gave you 24 um things but so it's not it's not that great nonetheless i'll buy some stuff i'll use it to uh, start building a team here i'll try to find a way to get my ps3 uh team um to show you my ps3 team and so i might do that at some point uh, but for now we'll leave it at this i hope you guys did enjoy it this is going to be a fun one uh, again playing manual is uh one of the uniquenesses of my lp i think compared to a lot of other players that play online um, one of the things that I want to do with this is actually find other players to play with. I think that could be a lot of fun for me and for you guys to watch uh, me play with some other players. Uh, same team, different teams, maybe do a clubs, a FIFA clubs, uh, which you can actually play 11 on 11 human players, everybody controlling their own. Um, and you'd find that like here, I think. No play. Pro clubs. Um, yeah, 11 on 11. It, that's... I would love to do something like that and get on Mumble and record and stuff like that. Uh, but until then, I will play uh, multiplayer uh, through seasons um, online on the Ultimate Team. Um, I'll do some stuff off camera as usual, and then I'll probably start doing game highlights to keep my episodes below 15 minutes, 15, 20 minutes. Uh, but do leave a thumbs up if you like this episode. I would love to keep doing this stuff. Um, and so thanks for watching. And uh, see you next time. Bye-bye.